the police have confirmed the Manda's raid on the new generation bank at Ijero Ikiti in Ijero local government area of Ikiti state, where armed robbers claimed four lives. This is the fourth bank robbery this year in Ikiti state, and lives have been lost in each of the robbery attacks. Correspondent Olaso Komi Gumuko has more in this report presented from our studios. The robbers, according to eyewitnesses, stormed the bank, which is close to the palace of the monarch Ajero of Ijerikiti, Adebayo Adewole, at about 4.30 p.m. and operated unhindered, shooting sporadically into the air and blew up the bank's security door with explosives before gaining entrance and carting away an unspecified amount of money. The raid on the new generation bank is coming barely three months after a similar incident at a first generation bank in Igedekiti, in which a policeman was killed. A bank staff and some other persons were said to have sustained injuries in the incident, which lasted about one hour. <laughs> Ekiti State PPRO said investigation has commenced into the latest bank robbery, just as investigations are still ongoing on the previous three bank robberies this year in the state. They, they used dynamite to gain entrance to, into the bank, and then uh, they took our men off guard because uh, they disguised by coming with an ambulance, uh, converting coffee, and then one would have thought that, okay, that was what uh, maybe they were carrying a dead body. And before we know what happened, they opened fire, you know, to gain access in, into the bank. The first bank raid was at Ifakikiti in April, with the second coming in May in Ilawekiti. In September, the robbers struck at Igedekiti and now in Ijerekiti. In all, lives were lost and the vandalized banks shut down, thereby denying thousands of people in the localities access to banking facilities.